One of the biggest things that's happened to me with contract stalking is I went to a gym in the Muskegon area in downtown Muskegon called the Lakeshore Fitness Center. And it used to be the old YFCA or YMCA or whatever. And I was down there and I was just minding my own business. And I wanted to like get away and be able to go to a place to where I wouldn't have all these people following me around and bothering me. And the contract stalking was going on in the place and the guy running the, one of the supervisors, Jeff Leland, that worked down there, like I definitely know he was involved with it. But I actually saw people from the, from the Lakeshore Fitness Center, like following me, like way out to Grand Haven, all different sorts of places. And I'm not making this up. You know, I was down there minding my own business and they would purposely send all sorts of people to follow me around the gym. And it would be like older women, middle-aged women, younger girls and all this stuff. And I'd be minding my own business. And this is back when they were doing like these re really weird, weird themes where they would hire women to show their asses. And like one time I was hanging out in the gym and there was like a woman and her daughter and some other people. And they hired like all these different women and girls to like start show like bending over and, and like going up and down and stuff like they were kind of like humping. It was weird. <clears throat> and they even hired a little girl that looked like she was like about nine, 10 years older to do it. And they were hiring older women. And like, I would leave out of one room and go to an next room. And like within minutes, the people would follow me in there. I'd leave like, and there was so many rooms and so many places you could be. It was unpractical for them to follow me to each and every single room. And you know, it was just insane. Like I had like, it was a horrible experience at the Lakeshore Fitness Center. And it just so happens that the guy in Norton Shores, Michigan, who was killed by the crossbro, the guy, okay, there was a murder in Norton Shores, Michigan, and somebody was murdered allegedly by a crossbow. And they said some guy named Nico Bull did it. He came from Grant, Michigan, all the way to Norton Shores and just killed some guy. For no, like, for no reason, and then went to Grand Rapids, and he was apprehended. But the the victim's brother was working at Lakeshore Fitness Center, and I was there talking to him when all this stuff was going on. And they would hire different women, especially like blonde women or redhead and stuff, to follow me around. Like literally every single room I went to, and it was such a horrible experience. I would never go back to the Lakeshore Fitness Center in my life. Like, I wouldn't recommend it to anybody for anything. They definitely got some pervert pedophiles who go in there.